Bye guys. Well, it is hot tub happy hour again, and I'm super excited. It's um, Wine Wednesday, and it's uh, April Fools. I promise I won't be playing any tricks on you today. I think um, what we're all going through right now has been the biggest trick of all. No more tricks necessary. Uh, but <laughs> we are going to have some fun, because it is Wine Wednesday. I am Sue Bonzel with 93.7 The Bull. Today, I've got Gloria. I wanna thank you guys for uh, weighing in on uh, which wine I should um, be trying today. And I think you guys know me because it's bubbles, especially when it's bubbles with bubbles. So I'm super down with bubbles. So if you haven't been to uh, Gloria Ferrar before, ah, oh, love that place. Beautiful views. They've got the wine caves there. Of course, the amazing sparkling wines. So a lot of people I am seeing are posting on Facebook that they are running out of wine during our little shelter in place, which can be a problem. Now, I want to give you guys some tips on uh, being prepared for this shelter, shelter in place now that we uh, just got, um, yep, that's it. Uh, since we just got uh, word that we are now up to May 3rd that we need to shelter in place, that's a long time. That's about 33 days. Now you probably saw the little video that Justin posted of the gal doing wine math with the fractions, which was freaking hilarious. If you haven't seen it, it's on our Facebook page. Um, she's wonderful. I'm doing a little bit of a different kind of math to help you guys get totally prepared for the next 33 days. I did the math, 33 days uh, of some more shelter in place here in Sonoma County. This is Gloria, by the way, <laughs> my best friend. Now people have asked me, how many glasses of wine are in a regular 750 ml bottle of wine, such as the one I just opened? And a lot of people will tell you different things. I'm gonna tell you it's about four glasses of wine. That's based on roughly six ounces of wine per glass. So four glasses of wine per bottle. I don't know about you, but on a really good night, that's not very much, it's only four, four glasses. And if you are sharing with anybody, boy oh boy, you're gonna need a little bit more than that. So, the way this works is 33 days, at least one bottle a day. Okay, I'm not calling anybody an alcoholic, I'm just saying, it might be necessary. This is, these are rough times we're going through. So, that's roughly 33 bottles. Now, if you're gonna be sharing with anyone, it's gonna be, possibly twice that much. So uh, give a call to your favorite local winery and support them right now. A lot of them are doing um, some uh, local delivery. That some of them are doing it for free. Um, some of them are doing $1 shipping, which is amazing. Uh, they're, they're eating the cost on that. Um, but definitely supporting our local wineries. That's your wine math to make sure you are prepared for the next 33 days. Very, very important. Now, secondly, uh, a friend of mine told me a really funny story. Um, everybody has been learning how to do Zoom. I talked to a gal today, I asked her, we made an appointment and I said, well, have you done Zoom before? And she said, I did for the first time today. So lots of people trying Zoom for the first time. It's been kind of interesting trying to figure out how to get the camera to work, how to get the audio to work, all of that good stuff. So my friend told me a story about her cousin who was doing a Zoom interview with the interviewer for a job, very important job. And of course her children are home, so she actually has one, one kid. And of course the kid starts to get unruly, screaming, climbing in her lap, all of this stuff. So first of all, she's a little bit stressed out about this job interview and her child, she's trying to no problem, the interviewer was, that's okay, totally understand. She happened to be in her bedroom at the time she was doing the uh, interview on Zoom, and her husband apparently was in the shower, did not know that she was doing an interview on Zoom, came out of the shower, hello, hi. Yeah, a little bit of a show there in the background. So um, I'm not exactly sure if she got the job or not, I don't know. 
depends on how good he looked. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I didn't say that. <laughs> Anyways, um, I don't know what ended up happening, um, but I'm wondering if you guys have heard stories or seen some really funny or odd things in the background of your Zoom calls now that we're doing them on a regular basis. So tell us about the funniest thing that you've seen in the background on somebody's Zoom call. Uh, funny, odd, weird, strange, whatever. I would love to hear about it. So um, I'm gonna have some more bubbles and some more bubbles from Gloria and uh, conclude my hot tub happy hour for today. Happy Wine Wednesday. Go open up a bottle of local wine. Support your local wineries. I'll see you on Friday. Ciao.